Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Let's consider the model for chemical reaction let's see let's see this chemical reaction where a combines with x and two times of x this is a certain kind of uh, chemical reaction where one molecule of Sx combines with one molecule of A and it produces two molecules of X. In other words, X is the X is the chemical which encourages or stimulates its own production. And uh, this kind of uh, this kind of chemical reaction is called autocatalysis autocatalysis this reaction also has back process in other words these two x will break and give one molecule of a and one molecule of now suppose x is the con concentration of molecule x and a is the concentration of molecule concentration of a let x be the concentration of uh, chemical x and a be the concentration of chemical a x is the concentration small x is the concentration for chemical x and small a is the concentration for the chemical a then suppose this is constant if we suppose this is constant or uh, it's an enormous amount that it can be treated as constant then the kinetics of uh, this concentration can be governed by the differential equation that is derivative of x with respect to time to be equal to k1 a x minus k sub minus 1 x square where this k1 and k minus 1 are rate constants our job is to analyze this differential equation or this dynamical system what we will be doing we will be looking at its equilibrium solution and uh, we will also see which of the equilibrium solution or equilibrium point is stable and which one is unstable and uh, also we will see that Stability means something which is sink or the tractor and unstability here means source or the repeller. So let's calculate the fixed points or the equilibrium solutions of this differential model. So in this case f of x is given by k1 times ax minus k sub minus 1 x square set this f of x to be 0 in order to find out equilibrium solutions then we get this over here and from here if we take this x to be common then we are left with this then either x is 0 or x is equal to k1 a divided by k sub minus 1 so there are two fixed points basically which are those one is x star to be 0 and other is x star to be k1 a divided by k sub minus 1 this is subscript now we will look at the stability of these two equili equilibrium solutions and we will see which one is stable so for that we can use linearization theorem derivative of f with respect to x is k1 a minus 2 times k sub minus 1 x f prime at 0 is going to be k1 a which is positive because k1 and k sub minus 1 are positive rate constants 
so this implies that x star to be 0 is unstable or you can say that it's it's a source or it's a repeller and uh, f prime at x star to be equal to k1 a over k sub minus 1 is equal to k1 a minus 2 times k sub minus 1 multiply by k1 a divided by k sub minus 1 and uh, on simplification we get k1 a minus this guy gets cancelled with this minus 2 k1 a which will give minus k1 a which is less than zero this implies that this equilibrium point x star to be k1 a over k sub minus 1 is stable in other words it's sink sink stable or its attractor so what does this mean this means that uh, the trajectories will ultimately uh, move to this equilibrium solution so this this equilibrium solution a1 a divided by k sub minus 1 is important why because it is stable and it's a sink and it's a tractor so we can say that uh, the solution x of t to this model which is k1 a x minus k sub minus 1 x square uh, will eventually lead to are the nearby solutions of this if you are taking initial condition nearby this then this x of t will remain nearby this so we can also like calculate the solution of this and see that the x of t will ultimately be going to k1 a over k sub minus 1 thank you